Hey guys, today I'm out here in Davenport, Florida, and I just think this would be the perfect opportunity for a first time home buyer. This home has it all, um, and it is a great price point as well. And this builder is offering some fantastic incentives. So I'm gonna tell you all about it inside. Let's go take a look. Today, we are in the community of Geneva Landings in Claremont, Florida, and we are touring the Parson floor plan. This floor plan is three bedrooms, two bathrooms, has a two car garage, and is 1,545 square feet. Make sure you watch the entire video because not only am I going to talk about this home, I'm also going to talk about the community, including HOA and CDD, as well as the area of Davenport, Florida, and what there is to do around here. This floor plan features a very nice split floor plan, so the first two bedrooms are towards the front of the house, and the primary bedroom is all the way in the back. Before we get into the good stuff, let me just take a moment to introduce myself. My name is Carly, the Enchanted Agent with Denise Realty Partners, and I am your Central Florida Disney-loving realtor. So if you're looking to make a move closer to the magic, reach out and let's find your happily ever after. Guess what? I'm not going to make you wait too long this time. Let's get into home pricing, but first a disclaimer. New construction home pricing changes very frequently, so please, if you're watching this video, either send me an email or you can call or text me, and I'm happy to get you up-to-date pricing on this specific home. At the time that I filmed this, the builder actually has one move-in ready home of this floor plan available, and it's listed at $345,135. And much like many other builders in the Central Florida area, this one is currently offering some really great incentives when you use their in-house lender. Incentives are subject to change at any time and can vary based on the specific home, but when I was at this community, they were offering to pay all closing costs and prepaids. Not only that, but they were also willing to help you buy down your interest rate and buy down the CDD annual assessment. One thing I really like about this floor plan is the wide open living area and it even has some higher ceilings which makes it feel much larger. As far as appliances go in the kitchen, at the time that I filmed this video, if you are buying one of their quick move-in homes, it was going to include all of the appliances as well as the blinds. Now, if you're purchasing a custom home, that may vary and all of the appliances may not be included. This kitchen is really what sold me on this home. Even though it's only 1,500 square feet, look how expansive this kitchen island is. There's just so much room down here. And I just think this would be such a good first time home buyer. Or if you're not looking for a huge home, this home really has all you need. And they utilize this space so well. Look at that pantry as well. You've got your own laundry room. I don't know. I'm just obsessed with this floor plan and I think you should be too. Before we continue touring the rest of this home, let's take a little break just to talk about Davenport, Florida. I'm going to talk about some drive times to some important places, and most importantly, I'm going to tell you where the best shopping is. Okay, so let's start talking about Davenport, and first I want to talk about the location. So you will see here on this map that Davenport is located in Polk County, Florida, and it's a great central location right between Orlando and Tampa, so it's a good location if you are looking to have easy access to either of those areas. Let's talk about some drive times from the community. So in order to get to Orlando International Airport, it's gonna take you anywhere from about 44 to 49 minutes, depending on traffic. Now, of course, this can fluctuate based on the time of day, but overall you can be at MCO in probably under one hour. Now let's talk about Disney. So Davenport is really popular due to its proximity to Disney. It's not very far away. It's less than 20 miles from Walt Disney World Resort. However, sometimes I-4 traffic can add a little bit of drive time to your commute. So from this community to get to Walt Disney World Resort, right now you're looking at about a 30 minute drive, but let's take that a step further and show you how far it's going to be from a park. So from Magic Kingdom, it's about a 35 minute drive. Of course, like 
I mentioned before, sometimes I-4 traffic can add some time to this drive time, but overall, you can be at the Disney parks in 35 to 45 minutes, generally. And last but not least, let's talk about the commute to downtown Orlando. Now, this one is a little bit longer. Right now, it's almost an hour commute. Um, I'm going to show you the problem spots on I-4 that you're generally going to hit on um, driving anywhere from the Davenport area. So there is this stretch of road right here, right outside of Walt Disney World. This is generally the problem area of I-4. Other than that, you'll see it's fairly clear everywhere else. Um, and that's always kind of going to be there unless you're driving at like 6 a.m. or 10 p.m. And last but not least, I did promise you shopping. So let's talk about Posner Park. So Posner Park is a massive outdoor shopping plaza and it's only a little over six miles away from this community. So let's get into what Posner Park has to offer. When I say they have a little bit of everything, I'm not exaggerating. So I'm going to go over the store list with you, but I'm not going to read everything because there are too many stores for you. Um, but just to kind of highlight some, there's a BJ's Wholesale Club, Bath and Body Works, Best Buy, uh, Crumble Cookies, Chipotle, CeCe's Pizza, there's a Sinopolis movie theater, which if you've never been to one of those, they're amazing, Dollar Tree, uh, Nail Salon, First Watch, Five Below. So you get the idea. There's tons of shopping, food, entertainment, um, and it's very close to this community. So definitely check out Posner Park next time you're in the area. So what do you think about Davenport so far? Pretty cool, right? Let's continue the tour and now we are going outside to this beautiful covered patio out here. I did want to point out that this is an HOA community and you'll see the amenities right here. The HOA is $150 annually. There is also a CDD. Unfortunately, I don't have that info right now, but maybe by the time you're watching this, I will. So send me an email. I could totally picture having this little chair out here, grabbing a book, maybe a nice margarita and relaxing for the evening. What about you guys? And you could probably use that cute fire pit like maybe once or twice a year when it actually gets cold enough to use it. All right, the time has come. Let's check out the primary bedroom. But first, I just want to take a second to talk about my involvement in all of this. You guys, it is really important that you hire a third party representation, aka a realtor like myself, to help you with the new build process so that you have someone that is fighting for your interests only. I filmed a video about why this is super important and I'll link it above. Also, if you just don't know what to expect with new construction. I have developed a free new construction guide. Just send me an email and I'll send that over to you right now. How great is this bedroom, by the way? Look how big it is. There's plenty of space for all of your furniture. It's a great size primary bedroom and the bathroom is pretty fantastic as well. The only downfall of this bathroom is there is no bathtub, just this walk-in shower here. But I still think that this home is a great deal. It's at a great price point and it gives you everything you really need, especially for those first time home buyers who are trying to start in the lower end of the price points and also maybe looking for some great incentives to help get your payments down. That concludes the tour of this home. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you want to see more like it. And also, if you have any questions about this home, community, or the area of Davenport, I'm happy to answer any questions you may have. All of my contact info is at the end of this video. So if you're looking to make a move closer to the magic, reach out and let's find your happily ever after.